first thing you do is bend this so you gauge how much solder you're putting in. And we're going to put in approximately the diameter of the fitting in each joint. So if this is a one inch fitting, I'm going to anticipate putting about one inch of that solder in. The second thing we're going to do is those globules of uh, flux that aren't in the joint, we're going to wipe off because the solder is going to follow the flux. We don't want to run flux up this rubber part. We just need a tiny bead of flux right there to draw the solder. Then we're going to heat evenly and quickly so we don't melt the rubber very much. <laughs> just going to draw it in. I'm going to move my heat around. The solder is going to follow the heat. I'm just going to chase this thing around here. So I get it to draw in nicely. So what we're going to do is I'm going to put something underneath it. Oh, that's a good idea too. You can see it sucking right up very nicely. It'll pull around here. We're going to put out the rubber as we ignite it. Heat underneath. So we're really sure about that. And also, once it's melting solder, you can let the heat off periodically so you don't overheat the whole thing. It's already hot enough. And then it's just a lot neater. I'm going to just do this real quick. Oop, not flip that on, Jeff. Looks good. That's drying out very nicely. I'm going to go around. Real good about that. So that looks nice without burning myself. Rubber's not ignited very much. <laughs> Not a whole lot anyway. Alright. Unions that allow you to ratchet, uh, to screw the two collectors together. The cost differential is significant. Go price a single union, just a union. And you'll see that on a multi-collector situation like this, you can increase your cost easily by another $100, $150 just in the hardware necessary to put these things together. So uh, some would grouse that this is a, a difficult operation to solder these two together. But as you can see in real life, it's really not too tough and uh, very inexpensive and quite practical. All right, that well, looks pretty that good. good. Now these are self-tapping screws, and a self-tapping well, screw can strip it out. So once you get them in there, stop. I need